want to talk to you for a second this week about resolutions. There's a lot of people bagging on resolutions. Like, why do you have to wait till January 1st to make your decision, right? I joined a gym because I can't run anymore. And so I joined a gym and I did it in uh, November because I wanted to get in before all of the new people jump in there, right? January gyms are full. And they're full a lot of times because people make these resolutions where they go, I'm going to eat better. I'm going to work out. I mean, I lost 15 pounds in the first quarter of last year because we started going Mediterranean, which we're doing again. And I think about it and I see people comment and I see people go, you know, don't make these resolutions. They don't last or whatever. And I always get frustrated when I see that because for me, I need a day where it's like day one. And it's hard on September 16th to be like, this is day one. For me, it's just easier to start every year with a, okay, now it's day one, let's go. And so I would encourage you this year to just make this day one. Don't shy away from the fact, just because everybody's joining the gym and they're gonna quit in 90 days, you jump in now and you make your decisions. But the other thing I would tell you is a lot of times we quit because of lack of accountability. And so those decisions you make for 2024 and you go, I'm gonna live differently, here's my accountability, just get that accountability partner who knows what you're trying to do and will hold you accountable to those things. My wife and I, when we went Mediterranean, I would have, I would have still eaten cheeseburgers. Like I would have rocked those things. But my wife was like, no, this is what we're doing. And I want to, I'm very competitive too. I want to like get after it. And so I stayed on that thing for the 90 days we said we would. And we only made a 90 day goal on that one. So make your goals, but get accountable to somebody who can tell you whether, you know, hey, you're off base or you're not doing it or, or, you know, how can I help you get back up? Because it does, like people start things that they don't finish. And a lot of times it's because they're lacking accountability. So decide you're going to do it, make that decision to take the first step and then get accountable to somebody to, do what you say you're going to do. If you do those things, you'll be way better off than somebody sitting back going, oh, I don't make resolutions. Well, you also don't do anything good for your body in those cases. So make your resolution, stick to it, get your accountability. That's my encouragement for you. And we will see you next week.